Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to share your screen on a FaceTime call in iOS 15 on iPhone and iPad. In iOS 15, Apple is bringing several enhancements to FaceTime. And now, you can do more than just FaceTime. Call your friends and family. Thanks to a new screen sharing feature called SharePlay, you can share your screen with other people on a call, which is great for choosing a movie, browsing through a photo album, or anything else that's enhanced by group discussion. That all being said, let's learn how the new screen sharing feature works in FaceTime app on iPhone and iPad. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. To get going, launch the FaceTime app on your iPhone or iPad. After that, tap on New FaceTime and add the contacts that you want to share your screen with. Then tap the FaceTime button. Alternately, select a recent contact to initiate a video call. Next up, when the call has connected, tap the share play button at the top right corner of the screen in the new control panel. Now tap share my screen in the drop down. After a 3 second countdown, screen sharing should start. Once FaceTime screen sharing has started, you can navigate to any app that you want to share with the callers. A sharing icon will remain in the top left corner of the screen to indicate that FaceTime screen sharing is active and you can tap it to reveal the FaceTime control panel. You can swipe away the active caller's face for more screen space and swipe them back into view just as easily. It's worth pointing out that if you are viewing someone else's shared screen, you will see their name just below the top left icon alongside buttons to send them a message, love what they are sharing or share it with someone else. If you like, you can also listen to music or watch movies and TV together using the share play interface. You can even stream movies or TV shows and everyone on the call will see the same sync playback and controls. That's pretty much it. So that's the way you can share screen in FaceTime app on your iPhone or iPad. Now that you know how this cool feature works, make the most of it to spice up your FaceTime. If you have found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone and iPad hacks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.